Hi, Logan here for Easy Coffee House, and today we're going to make some espresso on the Breville Barista Express. So to start, we're going to turn on the machine. And it's going to start warming up here, and it's actually warmed up because I had it on right before I started uh, shooting this video, so all the lights are on. Normally, though, all these lights would start blinking, or these lights over here would start blinking, and that just means that the machine's warming up. So once all six lights are on, you're all good. Now, I'd only like a single shot this uh, today, so I'm going to pull out my porta filter, take my screwdriver, and pop out the double basket, and put in the single wall, uh, single shot basket. And just slap that right in there. Now, uh, since I'm just going to be uh, making straight coffee today, there's no milk in our pitcher, so I'm just going to put that off to the side. I'm just going to place it in here and set the filter size to single and give it a bump. So as you can see, our Sumatra coffee was just uh, ground, and I'm just going to compact that now. And the easiest way to do that on this machine is just to take the handle of the portafilter and shake it up and down. And just jiggle it, and it comes out just like that, nice and beautiful. So now I'm going to come down here and let me show you. Take our integrated magnetic tamper, and we're just going to tamp that fresh coffee down and give that a little twist there at the end. And if there's any that spills over, just push it right back in, and then right along the edge. Tamper is now clean, it was right back inside, and now we're going to take our freshly tamped portafilter, place it into the head, and lock it in. Up top from the cup warmer. Show you up top. We have a cup warmer, and I'm not going to take my rocket ship cup. Instead, I'm going to take my just little standard espresso cup here, place it right down under the pour spout, and we're going to turn on the machine by pressing the single cup button or the single shot button. Right now, we're in our pre infusion stage, as you can see by the needle being down here, but in a moment. It should, if everything is correct, uh, the motor will ramp up, and now we're in our espresso range. And there we go. We're going to give that a second to settle. And we can see, if I adjust the camera, our nice, beautiful espresso. You can see that crema right on top. And uh, the trick, there's actually a quick little, a nice little trick with this machine. If you leave the portafilter in for about 30 seconds after you're done, it will suck that water out so that you have a nice dry puck. And after that, you just go bang it in your garbage can, let the uh, grounds fall out or into a collection bin if you want to um, compost them. And then the easy way to clean this machine is just after you have uh, wiped out your portafilter and made sure there's no grounds in it, just hit the single cup button again, and it will run water through there, and it will uh, flush all the grounds out of the machine. So, very, very easy to clean, and I am actually have another video on that if you'd like to see it. It's called Breville Barista Express Cleaning. This has been Logan for EasyCoffeeHouse.com. Thanks for watching.